Hi everyone, this is the boss Meta Basu here, uh, and welcome you all at Trends and Suggestion channel. Here today we are discussing about the most common topic that is on depression. So majorly, many people are uh, facing this disorder, that is the mood disorder. So we will be discussing about what are the causes, what exactly the signs of uh, and the uh, symptoms of depression. Sec third is well, what is the difference between grief and depression how you can differentiate it fourth is we will give you the means what are the what, uh, this particular um, disease means for, for this particular disorder what diseases you will be uh, getting if you are under a um, in a you know, stress or a depression and fifth is the remedies i will be discussing so please listen to the till the end of the video and if you need any assistance for the same please do feel free to connect me now first understand what is depression depression is considered as a mood disorder it may be described as a feeling of sadness loss or anger that interfere with the person's everyday activities it's also a fairly common uh, as you know depression is very common every maximum people in uh, different countries in india are facing the same so depression and the grief uh, share some features depression differ from grief felt after a traumatic life events depression usually involves self loathing or a loss of self esteem while grief typically does not in grief positive emotions and happy memories of the disease typically accompany feeling of emotions pain in major depression disorder the feelings of sadness are constant people experience depression in various ways it may interfere with their daily life act or activities resulting in lost time and lower the productivity it can also influence relationships and chronic health conditions conditions that can get worse in due to this depression includes arthritis asthma cardiovascular disease cancer diabetes obesity it's important to realize that the feeling down at the, at as a normal part of life sad and upsetting events happens to everyone but you are feeling down and hopeless on a regular basis you could be uh, dealing with depression depression can be more than a constant state of sadness or feeling blue general signs and symptoms of depression not everyone with a depression with experience the same symptoms symptoms can vary in severity how often they happen and how long they last so if you yeah, if you feel like this if you are uh, what to say if you are feeling that you are having the symptoms you are free to call me so what are this feeling sad anxious or empty feeling hopeless worthless and pessimistic pessimistic means negative mm -hmm. crying a lot feeling bothered uh, annoyed and angry loss of interest in hobbies and interests you once enjoy this uh, decrease energy or fatigue difficulty concentrating uh, rem remembering or making decisions moving or taking more slowly difficulty sleeping early morning awakening or oversleeping chronic physical pain with no clear cause like headache or or digestive problems and cramps thought of death suicidal harm or suicide attempts depression what are the causes there are several reasons for depression brain chemistry as uh, mentioned there may be a uh, chemical imbalances in the parts of the brain that manages the mood thoughts sleep appetite and behavior in the people who have depression hormonal levels change in the woman estrogen and progesterone during the different periods time like during the menstrual cycle postpartum uh, period perimenopause or menopause may also raise a person's risk for depression and please note that only not for the uh, uh, women but men also uh, face menopause family history family childhood trauma uh, men, medical condition pain substance use uh, history of substance or alcohol misuse can affect your risk so risk factors what are this 
for depression can be biochemical, medical, social, genetic, sex. The prevalence of the major depression is twice high. Socioeconomic status, vitamin uh, D deficiency. Now, what are the remedies which you use? I want to suggest you a few things. That is a psychotherapy, cognitive behavior therapy, uh, dialectical behavior therapy, psychodynamic therapy, uh, selective serotonin re uh, reuptake inhibitors, serotonin and non non repine ferine reuptake inhibitors, tricyclic and tetracyclic antidepressant, a typical antidepressant, no radical, no adrenaline and dopamine reuptake inhibitors, mono uh, mono monomine oxidized inhibitors and emthyl so if you are facing any problem relating to depression please do contrary to contact me i will be there for your support and if you like my video please subscribe it and please uh, share it among your friends and fellow uh, friends and your uh, relatives and to your uh, since it's a uh, more what to say educational uh the way i'm I mean, it's, it's uh, an educational video so i would suggest you to uh please reach out to your seniors as well to the persons who are looking for the p uh means uh, what to say they are to uh, who are there to do the researches they can also contact so i hope it's uh, video is helpful for you Please to contact me. My contact details will be provided in the description box. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day.